equals three studios. Hey, what's up next? What do you mean? The video. What, what video? What do you mean? The fucking thing we're shooting right now. That's right. Let's go to it. <laughs> yeah. A film by Brad Furman. I bought uh, pharmaceuticals at that hotel before. What do you mean, a film? Oh, there he is. He's got a uh, spider tattoo. This is my man, John Leguizamo. Oh, there's something shady going down. That's how much it's, he's paying John Leguizamo to be in the movie. You got those signed DVDs, man? It's not for me. You know, if you're gonna have a sneaky deal, definitely meet in front of the hotel where you're about to do the sneaky deal. That's awesome. You can tell it's a fantasy because it takes place in Los Angeles, but it's raining. Hey, that's, that's convenient. You could have had the whole meeting in the car, guys. There's a car there. And there's a beautiful model awaiting his arrival. Housekeeping? That's a giant bug zapper in that hotel room. CD Motel, really expensive clock. <gasps> Ooh, that is the prettiest woman at her front door. Oh, I'm sorry, that's Justin Bieber? Now, a lot of people think that Justin Bieber is playing himself in this. I actually got to read the script. His character's name, Shlomo Rosenberg. It's true. Hey, girl. Uh. Girl, I'm gonna look up soulfully at the camera, girl. Mm. Wow, I'm just really impressed by how dry he got that fast. Oh, yeah! Fight it and kiss it and fight it! It's getting hot and heavy. I feel like the director the whole time was like, wait, what do you mean? Prostitute? John Lee Kazamo? Wait, what do you mean? And then Bieber was like, exactly. When two women go at it, they are so beautiful together. Oh, I'm sorry, that's still Justin Bieber? Because you're running out of time. Is it is it, is it because she has her by the hour? Get it, Jay. Get it, Jay Biebs. Calvin Klein. Okay, he's come back from the future, and this is actually his mother. You know what? I've been there before. When a guy can't, like, you know, perform, he'll just, like, go to the edge of the bed and sing. I can't just do it on command. I need a nap every four minutes of making out. You just go ahead and talk to yourself. She's like, Justin, I said no. What do you mean? Hint of Jasmine on his chest. That's, we didn't know that, but. Uh-oh. V for Vendetta showed up. Independence for the French! Call me crazy, but I don't think holding Justin Bieber for ransom would work. It takes two guys to take down Justin Bieber? I don't think so. Uh, not the face, not the face. He like puts up no fight whatsoever. Justin is not defending her at all. She's like, don't, don't. I'd be like, wapa, wapa, shika! You'll notice, by the way, they're wearing a comedy and a tragedy mask, so I think they're being kidnapped by a high school thespian troupe. This is getting interesting. Ooh, they're in a... Trunk. Hey girl, I know we in the trunk, but let me be your big spoon. Mm. Amazing suspension in that trunk. They didn't get jostled once. She's like, we're fucking locked in a trunk. Will you stop singing to me? Don't light the lighter in the trunk. You're by the exhaust. You're gonna explode, you freak. Great, they, they're in a nice warehouse set. Good thing I brought this lighter, girl. Good thing they didn't check my pockets, girl. Mm. He saves the day. <laughs> oh, Justin, you're always so ahead of the curve. Both of their clothes were scotch guarded, so the only thing burning was the, the rope. That was convenient. Where are you guys gonna go? What are you gonna do? No, I know, the music just stopped. Now it's awkward, now we're in movie zone. No, this is not a time to make out. You have to run. Do you trust me? Sure, up to this point, the date's been awesome. You came over at like three in the morning and I got kidnapped. Why wouldn't I trust you? Worst Tinder date ever. Let's go. Whoa. We're gonna take a leap of faith and fall into love. Well, I don't like your metaphor. What is, oh my God. He fell into the lair of the Foot Clan from the 90s Ninja Turtles. There it is. Hey, I found Waldo. It was all a prank. And this is where I would kill Justin Bieber. Oh, I see, it was his buddy who was paid to kidnap the girl so she would fall deeper in love with them. You know, as you do when you like a person, you pretend to have a horrible violent crime so they fall deeper in love with you. Let's go to a skate party. Come on. Girl, you're gonna love this. We can watch me and all my homies skateboard. Mm. Everyone's very happy, and but when I'm listening to the lyrics, what he's basically saying is you have to have sex with me now or I'm leaving you. Yeah, that's rape. Uh, okay, so this is like a full-on skate rape. This is fantastic. Justin, get off the thing. They're trying to do some cool skateboard tricks. You're sitting on it the entire time. I would be so bored at this party. I'd be like, where are all the girls to talk to? Everyone's just skating. I think she's happy because there's a bunch of witnesses, so there's no way he could rape her. Also, who's skateboarding anymore? Isn't everyone riding hoverboards now? Come on, get with the times. If you're like fake kidnapping someone, you can't really like yell, gotcha, punked, and then have the whole room laugh. Fantastic, so nobody gives a crap that all these felonies were committed just so she could fall in love with him. It looks like there's a bunch of like 12 and 13 year olds at a rave. It's like one of those lock-ins they have for Christian schools. Awesome. Fucking stupid EDM bullshit. Anyway. I did it guys. She fell in love with me. She fell in love with me after I kidnapped her.
That's it. I'm gonna give that Yelp review of the hotel really, really bad scores because man, that kidnapping was super easy and no one came to help. I found it absurd and upsetting. And John Leguizamo has awards, he's a great actor, and he wasn't utilized well. I actually enjoy the video. Um, I kind of think Justin Bieber's hot. <laughs> Am I gonna get arrested for saying that? He's legal. But still. I don't believe that Justin Bieber would do that now that I've seen his penis. It's just too big for that, you know? Let's break it down for a second. What is this video really saying? What does it say about the cultural milieu? Um. <laughs> when there was a lot of cash involved, I assumed the girl was a prostitute because she was hooking up with Justin Bieber. The plot was still better than, than three out of the four Transformers films. That was amazing. If a guy kidnapped me and brought me to a skate park as a surprise, I wouldn't just break up with him, I would murder him. See, he gets to kidnap a girl and it's all fun and they make a music video of it. I do it and they gotta get the fucking police involved. This is setting a bad precedent for now if girls that watch this video when they actually get kidnapped, it's like the opposite of Taken. Instead of getting scared, they're gonna be like, oh my god, this is Bieber! <laughs> what do you mean? Oh, when you buy the visit, when you buy the visit, what do you mean? What do you mean? Guys, if we've learned anything, there's a right way and there's a wrong way to kidnap your loved one. So I hope you took note. And thank you so much for watching. I want to thank the comedians for stopping by. Let us know if you liked them. And if you did, let us know in the comments below. Okay, we're having a good time. Right now, I want you to look at my socials real quick. I want you to enjoy them. Take a quick stock at them and choose what you want. Because I'll be there waiting for you. Anyway, se me cuidan. Nos vemos. Justin Bieber se le vio el... Se le vio el... Hay foto de eso. Y tú sabes que yo te voy a decir algo. Hablando claro, yo creo que él sabía que le iban a sacar la foto y como que eso para calentarlo, ¿ok? Eso es mi teoría. Eso es mi teoría. Thank you for watching this Equal 3 Studios production. To watch another episode, click here. Also, don't forget to subscribe. And now, I sing. La 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 la. Thank you. Thank you.